Hi everyone, this is Melanie Wynn here. Um, I'm going to do a food a food review for you today and some food re and some reviews that are not food related. So I'm going to start off with this right here, this item. By Minute, cilantro and lime and jasmine rice, naturally flavored. 7 ounces, 200 grams, and you put it in for like 90 seconds, which isn't bad. Um, I actually like this. This was very good. It had a little bit of um, a lime can taste of lime and a little bit of the cilantro. So I'm going to give this a four and a half star rating for this. So four and a half star rating, so a thumbs up on that. That was very good. And my um, to my toffee, my toffee whole, um, whole hazelnut caramel and hazelnut cream and chocolate. These are delicious. So I give these a five star rating, so a thumbs up on that one. I love the taste of the caramel and the chocolate and the hazelnut together. This was delicious and very addicting. So, yeah, I recommend this. And I just had my cup of noodles, stir fry, teriyaki beef flavor, stir fry style Asian noodles and sauce. This and no M and there's no added MSG. So this was very good. I just had this for my lunch, and I give this a five star rating for this because it had the vegetables in it and the teriyaki sauce and you put it in the microwave and um, for about four minutes and you have to cover the you have to put the water up here at the line inside but I do recommend this um, very good flavor to this and um, so yeah like I said it's a five star rating for this and I'm gonna give it a thumbs up on this one I really enjoyed that And the next item that I did try is Sonic Ocean Water and Cherry Limeade. You get 10 freezer bars, but these were okay. You know, um, would I buy it again? Maybe, maybe not. I'm going to give it about three stars for, the, for these. So I'm going to like like this because I, I don't know because it's, it's not bad. It really isn't that bad. So, yeah, three star rating for these. And of course, my Sarah Mist, which I love this stuff. One of my favorite drinks. I'm going to give this a five star rating and a thumbs up for that. I could taste the lime and stuff in this, and it's refreshing. I love this drink. It's one of my favorite drinks. The next drink is the Blueberry Lemonade. And, um,. It's basically, oh, it's not good. It's not really that good. I tried it. It tastes more like diet lemonade and blueberry, and I don't like the taste of diet, so, and I, I have to watch the aspartame, but I didn't realize that, I don't think it has any of that in here. Let me check. Yeah, by mistake, I bought this, because I should have read it properly. It has aspartame, so, yeah, I didn't really like this. So, if it, it, if it was sugary, I would like this. But it just tasted blah, so I'm going to give this a one-star rating and a thumbs down. I really did not enjoy that at all. The next one is the Twisted Punch. Um, this one wasn't bad. Not It had a nice flavor to it a little bit, but not as bad as the other drink. So I'm going to give it like a three-star three, three star rating for this one and in the middle, you know. So it wasn't bad. Okay, next to this, um, the more of the food section here by Global Brands, Waffy, um Cubes. It's strawberry cheesecake flavored wafers. I really enjoyed these. These were really good. I give this a four and a half star rating for this. It didn't have a strong cheese, uh, cream cheese flavor, but I didn't taste a little bit of the, the, the strawberry. It was very good. So four and a half star rating, and I'm going to give it a thumbs up on that one. That was very good. And the next one is the Bud's Best Cookies, but Vanilla Wafers. These were very good. I'm going to give these a five-star rating. I really enjoyed these. They're just as good as the regular vanilla wafers that you get in the store. So these are really good. I really enjoy this. So four and a half star rating for this. And actually five-star rating. And a thumbs up on that one. Because that was very good. And also...
the um, the Milky Way salted caramel. I still got some left, but I really enjoyed these as well. I could taste a little bit of the salt in this, the salt and chocolate together. It's delicious. I absolutely love these. I like salt. I love salted caramel. I'm gonna give these a five star rating to these because I really enjoyed the salt and chocolate together. So salt and sweet. So I'm gonna give this a thumbs up for that one. And Mrs. Friendly's Delicious Deals, um, Glazed Honey Buns. I really love these. So you only get six in a box, but they're very small, but they're very good. I love the taste of this stuff. It tastes like, it is a honey bun, but it's, you can taste a little bit of the cinnamon in it. So I'm going to give this a five-star rating and a thumbs up for that one, because these are very good. And we're going to move on to the Stacy's Pita Chips Parmesan Garlic and Herbs. These were okay. They didn't have much of a, a flavor to the. I didn't taste the Parmesan Garlic and Herb in this. It just tastes like regular pita chips. You know, I like pita chips, but it didn't have these strong flavors that I, that I was hoping they would have, but unfortunately. So, you know what? I'm still going to give it a point. So, I'm going to give it. Because I like pita chips, I'm going to give it three star rating for this. So I'm going to go in the middle. They're not bad. I wish it had a stronger Parmesan garlic and her flavor to that. I would have been a little bit happier with that. And the next um, items that I did try for the, the um, by Global Brands, again, Choco Dips Caramel Cream. I had one today. These were actually very good. I can't taste the caramel in it, but the chocolate is still good. So I'm going to give this a four and a half star rating because I couldn't taste the caramel. But other, overall, this was very good. So four and a half star rating for these. And a thumbs up for that. those. These, I like the taste of these chocolate ones. These are delicious. I wish it had a strong caramel flavor to it, though. The next one is the Choco Dips, just the regular chocolate by Global Brands. Um, these I really did like a lot, um, because they have the strong flavor of the chocolate. could taste the chocolate in this quite a bit. So I'm going to give this a five-star rating for these, because I could taste the chocolate. So, five-star rating for these, and a thumbs up. I really enjoy these. The next one is the Peach Jelly Beans, the Lemon, Strawberry, and Marshmallow. I really enjoyed these a lot, so I could taste the marshmallow and the strawberry and lemon and blueberry. These were really good. I'm going to give these a five-star rating for these and a thumbs up. I really enjoyed that. And the next item that I did try and I love by Planters Cheese Balls. I love these. I taste, it's very cheesy. To me, it's very cheesy. So I'm going to give it a five-star rating for these by Planners. Very good. Um, so a plus a five-star rating and a thumbs up. And next um, is the, I call them UTZ, uh, 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 the Crab Chip Potato Chips by Chesapeake Bay Crab Seasoning. These were okay. I wasn't a big fan of them. I tried them, but they were okay. You know, I, I was not too keen on it, but like I said, it's okay. So I'm going to give them a two-star rating for these. And kind of a thumbs down. Yeah, I didn't really enjoy these too much, but they're okay. They're edible. The next one is the removal hooks. They're like the command strips, and um, I really like these a lot. I did use a couple, as you can tell. I have a few left. I really like these, and they do hold up very well. Um, no issues. I use it for my um, to hang up my sign over here in front of me, or behind me. I did use these for that, for my sign, and they do hold up very well. I really, really like these. I'm going to give these a five-star rating and a thumbs up on these. And I did try the Spa Naturals Aromatherapy Shower Fizzies, and you get four in a pack. Um, when you open it up, I can show you what it looks like inside. 
it's got plastic cover in this, which is a good thing. When you open the pla the package, I mean the plastic on this, I smelt it. You can smell the eucalyptus and you can smell the um the spearmint. It does have the smell of that, but I did put it in the shower. I did I follow directions. I did put it on the floor in my bathtub and Unfortunately, it does get hot in my shower, but unfortunately, it, does, it doesn't steam up very good in my bathroom. So, I really couldn't smell anything because, again, it's hot. It does, and I thought it would do that, but it didn't because, it's, like I said, again, it doesn't get too steamy in my bathtub. But some people may have better luck with this, but it does smell good when you take it out of the package. Um, Because I like the smell a lot overall. I'm just going to give it a three-star rating. So maybe some of you might have better luck with this in your showers. Maybe you'll have a lot of steam, unlike me. I don't get a lot of steam. So because it smells good, I'm going to give it a three-star rating. And I'm going to go like that. It's okay. Not bad. Um. Also, the Exacto knife from um, the Dollar Tree by Crafter Square Um. The knives work very well, but on, to put it in, it does not go in. This was not made right, so I was very disappointed. I'm going to give it a zero. This is not going to get a rating for me, so yeah. So I'm going to say, yeah, thumbs down. Unfortunately, I couldn't even use this. And also, I tried to love my carpet and it smells so good. I can smell the lavender dreams. It, this stuff it smells awesome on my carpet. I love this. I'm going to give this a four and a half star rating because I love the smell of the lavender. So, plus, I'm going to give it a thumbs up for this. I totally recommend this for the carpet. Anyways, people, um, I'm going to say um, I'm going to do part two of this video because I have more stuff I want to I review with you. So, I'm going to say ta-ta for now.